New Zealanders will be given another chance to get rich quick. We've already got Lotto and the Scratchies, and now we're getting a Kiwi version of one of the world's oldest games of chance, Kino. The promoters say Kino will help raise more money for charity, but critics argue it will lead to more crime. Ewart Barnsley reports. Daily Kino winning numbers. Numbers, 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 and if you get it right, they add up to money, money, money. This is how the draw for Kino will appear on Channel 2 next month, five days a week at 6.59. How do you play Daily Kino? Kino players Kino select up to a maximum of 10 numbers, between 1 and 80. In every Four, Daily five, Kino six, draw, 20 eight, numbers eight, are selected. Eight, if your numbers match, you're a winner. Anything from $2 to a million. But so far, I don't normally win anything, so... No matter. In Kino, if none of your numbers are drawn, you can still be a winner. The game's promoted by the same organisation behind Lotto and Scratch Kiwis. We've got a stiff budget this year. We, we have to produce much the same as we produced last year, which was a record year, and we will need new products like Kino to make that. Kino's played in the States and Australia, but here... Kino, I've never heard of it. Kino, no, wouldn't have a clue what it is. I'll be playing that, for sure. Not everyone, though, is that enthusiastic. To some extent, it'll be a problem for existing pathological gamblers, but the concern really is more for the creation of, of new people that have major problems and their family members in the wider community in the case of white-collar crime. And We're in gaming, not gambling. Our products come out of the discretionary income area. They're a very small amount from a, from a large amount of people. Kino's impact, good and bad, will best be judged from the end of next month. Ewart Barnsley, One Network News. And weekly sales of Kino are expected to be between $300,000 and a million dollars.